uh, invite my director, the director of IT Bombay, Professor Devang Kakar, to give his opening remarks. Professor Sudarshan Ayangar, Mr. P. R. K. Murthy, Mr. Ajay Kumar Bhatt, Professor Kriti Ramamritam, Professor B. K. Chakravarti, uh, distinguished invitees in the audience, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, first of all, I'd like to congratulate uh, all participants in the hackathon, uh, many of whom are in the audience. Uh, thank you so much for traveling to Bombay, uh, working so hard for the five days that you were in the campus, uh, putting your mind and heart into your problems, and coming up with really great projects. So congratulations, and thank you all for coming. I think each one of you uh, did a great job. Of course, only a couple of teams from each of the three areas uh, were recognized, but I know that this experience would have been very enriching for all of you, and I'm sure that you would have made many good friends through this experience. Uh, you know, there is another part of this hackathon that is all the professors and students of the IITs who ran the hackathon. Uh, I'd like to put on record my sincere thanks. Uh, you know, it's one thing to solve a problem, but it's quite different to set reasonable problems that can be solved in uh, two or three days. Uh, to do all the logistics, provide support for making all the things that you did. So my thanks to all the faculty and students of the IITs who put this together. This was led by Professor Kriti Ramamritam and Professor B.K. Chakravarti, who are on the audience, or who are on the dais, but many others also participated, and a large number of PhD students participated in helping the teams. and. There were faculty from all the IITs who are also participating in this process. You know, this hackathon is turning out to be a wonderful process for driving innovation, as it's uh, written on the screen over here. As many of you know, hackathons really started from computer programming. That, uh, you know, there was a problem to be solved, and then the computer programmers, also called hackers, would get together and then they would sit continuously for days on end to solve that problem. So, this is been going on for many years in the field of computer programming, but now it has become extended to many other fields. And really, the key ingredients of a hackathon are that first, it is a competition, that there are many people in, uh, in a certain uh, area who are looking at different problems and maybe alternate solutions. And this type of competition releases a lot of creative energy. All those who are participating, they try and come up with great new ideas. And they would like to come up with an idea that is better than any of the other teams participating in this competition. And so as a result of this pressure, as a result of this concentrated effort, hackathons often come up with some very interesting ideas, some very interesting solutions. As many people say, 
uh, you know, there's a possibility of getting out of the box solutions from hackathons. This particular hackathon, and I had a chance yesterday to go and look at each and every one of the projects, and I saw that there were many new, interesting, and non obvious ideas that the students came up with in the short time that they had to participate. Uh, so I think overall, I felt very pleased with the effort and with, and as you will see, some very unique things have been developed. Looking at the result, I'm quite convinced that this is a great way to generate innovations in a short time and there is a possibility that some of these innovations could end up as being commercialized either through transfer to some industry or as startups. And I think this is something I'd encourage all the participants in the uh, hackathon to think about. Uh, you have come up with this idea. If you're passionate about it, whether you won a prize or not, please think if this idea can finally be put into practice. Another very useful aspect of the hackathon is that it's a great way of learning about issues. Uh, the three topics that were chosen, water, energy, and transportation, are really very pressing problems of all our cities, all our urban uh, concentrated areas. And really, all of us need to think of solutions, uh, different kinds of solutions, some technological and some not. And through this hackathon, I'm sure that all the teams participating would have been made aware of what are the issues in these important areas, what are some of the constraints, and uh, you know, what are some of the tools that we can use to start addressing these problems. So I hope that in addition to everything else, that the hackathon experience has also been a, le a learning experience for all of you. Uh, I am quite looking forward to the presentations, as I'm sure everybody else in this audience is. Uh, I thank all of you who have come here, and, uh, uh, and I hope that you know, what you learn about this hackathon can be replicated in other areas as well as in other institutions. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Um, as you all.